Today, my lovely people, welcome here again to my channel, Eleanor's Chronicles, and my name is Eleanor. My lovely people, it's been quite a while. I haven't shot some videos in quite a while, and the reason for that was that uh, fiber was down in our area, and it was only fixed like yesterday late. So, today I was trying to catch up much as I can. So uh, let's see for the first video. Yes, I want us to talk. Delve into Indabaga Owan. Oh, mm -hmm. me keeps on paying the keep the gift that keeps on giving, eh? Minangas, I, I I don't know. Is it a good or a bad thing? I guess the jury's out on that. However. I promised you during the day. I said that a maslande in Davalega or a missing in an umgosilo soon getting a bye baby this time. And the reason I was saying that was because, you know, Mina, in everything, I see a teaching moment. I see a teaching moment in everything that people do. Let's get into Indabaga Oami and dissect it so that we can all get into pa ugutu mangiti masila ndenge paipele kulmangan. So, um, Oami all along, he keeps on saying ugutu, you know, much as akulumango ngohabi, and she says she's relaying her experience. But then people, if we get to listen to Ama Story Times Ka Owami, there's a difference between somebody giving um, their experience, you know, telling their life story, telling their truth, and somebody dragging somebody else. What Owami is doing is dragging. Uhabi, dragging. The parents ziga habi, dragging. Ukoko ga habi, dragging. The auntie ga habi, dragging. Abazugulu. Everybody's fair game go on. And she, in her defense, she says, no, if I'm lying, big guy can come out and tell a story. Maybe we need to understand, please define so that we all understand. Because maybe big guy is confused. Define this what will constitute a big guy doing that? Because since he and herself, Uoami said, a big guy can give his story, a big guy came out, gave his story. And to big guy giving his story, he is now Uoami, the same Uoami who said, Magaze as an story, Uoami is turning around now saying, big guy fast. Remember an interview ga Mrs. Makunyani, one of the major, major complaints ziga big guy or concerns rather than a complaint, maybe let's say one of the concerns he said he had previously because he's been over it. One of the concerns he he, he had in the marriage, which is basically what broke their marriage was that Uowami was belittling him. Uowami had no problem emasculating him in that marriage. He felt emasculated. He was being castrated every second in that marriage. And Uowami, we approve of Ulolo Robo. Because Uowami, not only to be guy, Uowami, even to general people he doesn't know her own viewers he just belittles everybody and calls everybody a mad dumb cop everybody uh, emo emotionally unintelligent mm? so everybody except her is in uh, inadequate on this plan so Konamanje, he came, Oami came out in response, ye video le, um, sis, makunyane, If 
you got to see both the video and the debriefing did by o Mrs. Makunyane. We're not going to do the blow, 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 lazy, buzz, we must say it in. But then if you saw the video and the debriefing, then you see a uh, video ga oami ayenzi. Then you will end up asking, maybe, maybe you should have watched. Because now you are sounding very dumb. You sound dumb, copperak, le ubizu utabantu ubaizu. Because U Oam is coming out saying, uh, Mrs. Makunyane, uh, her womb is rotten. Imagine that. In Chambinga, in Fasi. Does U Oam know Uti Umasiti is Beleto Siboli, yes, is Kumangan? I remembered a certain verse and I thought I should share it with you. My lovely people, let's get into it. Let's get into it. The verse that um, I was thinking about is right there in Galatians 6 verse 4 up to 9. And it reads like this. Open quote. Each one should test their own actions. Then they can take pride in themselves alone without comparing themselves to someone else. For each one should carry their own load. Nevertheless, the one who receives instructions in the word should share all good things with their, instruct with their instructor. Do not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. A man reaps what he sows. Whoever sows to please their flesh, from flesh they will reap destruction. Whoever sows to please the spirit, from the spirit they will reap eternal life. Let, not, let us not become weary in doing good. You know, sometimes, my lovely people, when you read something in English, then yes, um, I'm going to ask you to bear with me. See, landing is in the red. The same one. Ne? Okay, let's check. So, Abakaladia in Esindebelin, it is. Omunye no munye gufanele atholisi se imsebenzi yake. Ngemba wa lo koge angazi kakazi sa. Um, Ngokungo wake. Ingasi gugwabanye. Ngomba na omunye no munye gufanele atwale umtwalo wake. Aguti nanyana ngubani ufundi swa ilizwi. Abela nena loyo umfundi sayo. Um, Dizo zonke izindo ezikhi. Ninga kotiswa uzimo agapoko. Umuntu uvuma. Umuntu uvuna akjalileyo. O chalela inga nuko zake uza kufuna upupa. Ogu vela, ogu vela gizo. Koto ana o chalela umoya. Uza kufuna upila ogu ngapeligo. Uh, guye umoya. Asinga dino ukwenza ukulungileko gombana. Gesikati esifaneligi leo siza huvuna na, na gube asipeli amandi. My lovely people, there's a point to this. Please, bear with me. Bear with me. We're gonna go esutui. Esu tuini iti. Ki bakhalata ne. Bakhalata musi sutung. Iri wana. Mutu kam. Mutu kamu atlashube di kezo za hai. Ibe hona ai torisa. Kaseo alenso na fela. Isi nka hui babi salbaban. Hubani mutu kamu utla icharela mifokolo ya hai. Ya rutu angle nzwe la mudimu eka kona arule la ne marua hai woshe le ya murutang. Lise ke la itetza mudimu haa somwe. 
gobane seo motho a se jalang ke seo a tla se kotula ya jalang chimong ya tsa botho o tla kotula go bola ha yona empa ya jala tshimong ya tsa moya o tla kotula bophelo bo sa feleng re se khathale ho etsa tse molemo go bane re tla kotula ka nako ka nako e lokelang haiba re sa tepeng my lovely people the reason i wanted us to look at the scriptures is because um yesterday when i when my tv switched on it was on a oh i miss channel and it was so interesting that whatever she was accusing umisis law of actually reflected on her that's exactly what was reflecting on her hmm? because o o ami uh says umisis law one likes playing victim which is owami's modus operandi o owami always remembers which she is motherless once she does something that just goes south then when she comes back she will come back with the i don't have the mother now hmm? how convenient i mean how convenient imagine if every time i'm going to act out of character and i'm going to say no that's because that uh, my mother died before i could actually know her like ah, jan hmm? right now she got a new one hmm? apparently a uh, oh mrs law and big guy they went for her womanhood uh, when they spoke about her hygiene whereas for yena she did not go for big guy she did not emasculate big guy every chance she got mm -mm. she did not on this victimhood we can take it see see nayo ngabunye ngabuni hmm ati no bathize umntwana sekhaya ufune ayenza i abuse is going to traumatize eh abantwana basekhaya yet no one got traumatized when she came out here and stated ukuthi kabo big guy Gabo big guy by a lawyer. Gabo big guy. But the there's an aunt who go who goes around infecting people with uh HIV. I mean, going straight for her career. Hmm. Cause now all the patients that are treated by her have to look at her sideways. Hmm. That is not going in for mrs low's kids when every time she has to highlight uti now mrs low a uti ze hakmatorokis to abantwana baga ndota yake she will say no but then uh she said it herself but then now you said it yourself well even worse when herself as utatwa abo bofuna ukwenza abortion ngumntwana kini umphakathi loyo because it's it's her choice and her choice alone alone hay something lelo ukuthi was supposed to skip when i your mind inqondwa kobe ifunane lapho even for a split second to but no victimhood ahambe ayoyenza the despicable apparently allegedly 
Gupume ama rumors uguti. She allegedly made uh, a video stating how she is tempted to take um the address that Mrs. Low um and hand it to some dangerous individuals. Then she comes out running to deliver this um video because now she has to shine the light. The villains have to be uh, Mrs. Low, the guy who emasculated more. It's not enough what you did to him during the marriage. Now you're going to emasculate him and call him a woman. Unprovoked. Big guy said nothing malicious. Again, you can go to somebody underline where big guy was malicious. Hmm? Now you're calling him a woman. Yet, Bona, they came for your womanhood. So, now you have, she has to come out, Abba Pente, as villains. And it's in Owami's character, my lovely people. It's in Owami's character to always be little, cut people down to pieces. Hence, I was Pumati. I haven't started because I'm Owami. Yes, you are Owami, baby girl. You are Owami. We know you. You are the one. Loyal Guti, you do not know another person. Much as Ati Yena, they came for her womanhood, she goes on to say, Is Beleto Siga Mrs. Lu's body? That is the worst thing you can say to a woman. Does she even know what that means? Kunavanya Bantu, Bataga Tabanga Jabis would buy a Tagata because that's a spiritual state. But then I doubt she does not know what that means, seeing that Ubuya is on Tweni Liga Bushiri, the cult of all cults. So what are you trying to insinuate, Owami? Are you trying to kiss Abandana Baga, Mrs. Lowe? There's certain words, lazy Iluguti. Even for, even for for likes, for views, for you do not utter. Because the tongue holds the power of life and death. Therefore, you do not go around saying other things. Well, Yana self in her defense, she says that she says Isbele Tosiga eh, Mrs. Lusibolile simply because Mrs. Lo does not know um how to take care of other people's kids unlike her yeah now we are was with a nagagela abanyaba that is why a nagagela then means it no that does not mean that because oh i mean actually i was only human to him hence you are out there every day ukuluma the way abandu balambenga corner ukuluma the way abandu and what is there beneath you in a corner? So, what are you saying? What when you can be mother up and above, outside of your blood? Your niece is not it. It's not it. Oh, oh, I if she wants to know, Umasiti Umundu is a mother to nations. Is the type of person, Lo Ilu Uguti, Uno Kogo, Pezula Waki, to be able to carry other people's burdens. A mother who can be a mother to the motherless. And Uowami does not fit the criteria. No, that nation can be a nation of zombies.
Galatians 6 talks about somebody is spirit led. Somebody is able to step out, step forth and out of themselves in order to lead other people out of their hardships into whatever destinations that they are supposed to take in life. Those type of people are those kind of people obabona ilugute abazalanga yet in their own neighborhood we can actually point uguti uyamazuban banu one enji o ugupi gupi ukulisue umasbanyoni Money, the nurse, Kuliso Maspanyon. But she has the whole neighborhood calling her mama, yet she never boils it. Or she has one baby, but everybody is calling her mama because she's the disciplinarian, she's the everything, she's the one who was able to nurture. Pure strangers, the community, and bring out various gifts from various people, various kids, build marriages. She's a counselor of not, and Uom does not fit the bill. But then, Galatians 6 says that that is what we all need to aspire to be. Be a little bit kinder to each other. Stop being full of yourself just for a minute and remove so that you can see the next person in front of you. Because a road traveled by two people, you can actually cover a wider distance than traveling it alone. And in so living, living your life in a way that is giving to the next person is actually more fulfilling at the end of the day, you will find that you have actually led a more fulfilling life. Another example of what Uoan was trying to paint herself as, of which she's not. There's a Bible verse, there's a Bible verse uh, that tells a story about Jesus and one of his disciples uh, I think it's Peter, if I'm not mistaken. And Jesus asked this disciple, he says, uh, so and so, do you love me? And the disciple says, yes, master, I do. Then Jesus asks again, do you love me? Then the, the disciple goes, goes like, yes, Lord, you know I do. Then Jesus asks again and says, so and so, do you love me? Then uh, the disciple says, But why, Lord? You know I do. Then Jesus finally tells him what? He says, Then feed my people. As an Uoami paints herself as somebody who the value of the next person when she actually doesn't. Actually, agaboni the next person na needs. Oawami is the type of woman loyal who can find you walking next to the road. A driver up telling a man zi we so rich lie loyal to Aisha next street. And let's just cut you late for an interview. You you will zone the pain with two pages na lolola. Angazi, my lovely people. Um, please, let's continue the conversation down in the comment box and tell me, 
um ukuthi nina how did you see this and the scriptures do you uh, connect to the scriptures yes or no and let's take it from there and thank you for subscribing please do hit the like and the notification button so that you're notified every time i upload some content